Hey folks, this is Trask Nari, and I am joined today by Puddle. Hello, I am Puddle. We are going to be playing Silent Hill 2 Restless Dreams, which is one of my favorite video games of all time. Same. And, uh... And, uh, this is, uh, this game will be, this will be a little spoilers, will happen when we reach the spoilery parts of the game. Other than that, we'll try not to spoil things before the parts of the game. So You'll try not to spoil things, I Got will it. try not to spoil things. We're not going to be doing the sub-scenario because I'm a rebel, and I am also a coward, so we're not going to do hard difficulty. Yeah. That would require memorizing all sorts of different puzzles. I, I have done the first part of this game, like... This is going to be the third time I've done, like, the first hour or so of this game. Because it turns out the Xbox 360 doesn't I, like Silent Hill. I am playing this on the on an old scratched Xbox copy of the game being run on an Xbox 360, which has a crappy Xbox emulator that causes the game to fail to boot if you used more than one save file, which I did because as a good survival <laughs> horror fan, I cycle my saves. On. If you have not played this game before, shame on you. If you haven't played it before, this might not be the let's play of choice, but... <laughs> we will try to keep spoilers light for those who have not played it. Uh, yeah. The main thing is going to be... This is James! You might want to turn it up a little bit. Uh, okay. I'm turning up the audio. Yeah, James, just look at yourself shamefully in the mirror. Or don't. Don't. All right. Just uh, spin in circles. Yeah, shamefully cool. with yourself. All right, we are James. This is the worst bathroom that we have seen yet. Yet. And I always end up accidentally running further into the bathroom at the very start of this. Uh, you do not need to know the story of Silent Hill 1 to get to understand That's this That's the great game. thing about Silent Hill 2! <laughs> it is a completely standalone story. You do not need to play any other Silent Hill game to get this. I mean, technically the story is sort of continued in 4, but not really. <laughs> uh, more, it's more like 4. Uh, 4 has stuff that hints at it. Mm -hmm. This is important. Silent Hell. Silent Scope. Promise they take you there. You totally broke your promise and you're awful. Yeah. What, what the hell, James? I'm alone. What the hell? She's Eating Ben there. and Jerry's. You know the place where you promised to get me Ben and Jerry's? I mean, you alone there. It's all your fault. Seriously, I'm going to knock this game a lot, but it's still one of my favorite of all time, so... Mm -hmm. d d don't misunderstand. <laughs> She called me her little lamb. There's only one Mary in the world. There's only one Mary. No one writes me letters. <laughs> well, maybe... Maybe she was a superhero all of her life... And then it's only just now been revealed the fact that she had a very specific superpower, which is the ability to write letters from beyond the grave. That is the only power that she's been granted. We all have superpowers. And That's it's your first. fault, James. Again, it's your fault. This is totally your fault. It's your fault for not paying the mafia. And they came and they broke her legs. It was awful. It was terrible. It was terrible. Oh, well, wait, we said no spoilers. No spoilers. Uh, you might want to turn it up a little bit more. Because well, what I found out when you did the practice run with me is yeah. dialogue's kind of quiet, but then you hear the screams of things much louder. And the gravel. Oh, is God, the okay? gravel. Is that better? I have noticed no difference. Watch the recordings actually picking up way better than Skype is. Probably. It's fucking peaking. That's about how, as high Headphone as Headphone wearers are screaming in the distance. It's about as high as I can put it without uh, the hit sounds going to be deafening somebody. Uh, important to note, I forgot this on my second time through, you gotta go look in the car. You didn't get, get a map the second time? Well, you have to get it, he won't continue on without it, but, like, I uh. ran ahead and got really confused because I'd forgotten you, you You don't have the map to start out. By the way, uh, this is the reason why you don't, you can't just drive around, because you have to go through what I like to call the worst intro to the best game ever. 
I don't it actually think it's better. I swear. Yeah, this is the, you know, like like you know how when you show someone a YouTube video and you just sit there really awkwardly as they Waiting just for them to laugh at it. Yeah, that's the uh, first part of Silent Hill Two, because for a good like twenty minutes, you're just gonna be staring at James's back and listening to this. So congratulations, sound welcome to the first part. Welcome oh, to Silent Hill. Speaking of twenty minutes, I have not been checking my phone. <laughs> Okay. How long has this call been going on for? This is the 13 minutes so far, but we spent like half that time trying to get audio levels calibrated. That makes sense. Well, I mean, I'll be we'll be able to see how long I've been in game because I'll be saving pretty soon. Yeah, that'll work. Maybe. Again, if you have this game, uh, this ga uh, an Xbox copy of this game, and are planning on running it on an Xbox 360, don't only, stagger your saves. Only use one save file. <laughs> Otherwise, the it's not even the case that the game will become corrupted. The game will fail. Oh, also, to note, uh, forewarning, this game is going to be glitchy as fuck with uh, graphical Yeah, we've glitches. been having some graphical errors in the... Like we said, we did a practice run, and sometimes things just freak out. Yeah. Uh, keep an eye open for these little red things. These will make you very happy. Because uh, what they I'm worried about later, actually, is there's a crucial cutscene that's, you know, just part of the general story, but it stammers like crazy, it and we had to awesome. skip it because we were scared. We were yeah. scared it was going to mess up the game. I, I still don't know if it's going to mess up the game, so if it does it again, I might let it play out a bit just so everyone can see it, but then I'll skip it. Uh, God, that was loud. Let me mute for a sec so I can set this alarm. All right. Hope you guys enjoy that gravel sound effect. It's going to continue for a while. And here we meet one of the supporting characters of Silent Hill 2. Music in this game is beautiful, by the way. Alright, the alarm has been set. Cool. So about every 25 minutes it's going to go off. Sweet, this first episode might be a bit longer. Which yeah, is, which oh well. Great A voice acting in this game. Find out if I'm being sarcastic or not. I don't know, but all I can think of whenever James speaks is he reminds me of that scene in The Happening when uh, Marky Mark tries to placate an angry houseplant. <laughs> Are you okay? Is Silent Hill this, this way? general direction I'm pointing in? Don't you guys care about what happened to the bees? Come on, guys. Don't fucking talk to me. Not that I'm gonna stop you or anything. This, uh, th this town, there's something wrong with yeah, it's it's the town, sweetie. It just keeps spawning horrible sequel after horrible sequel. They keep getting worse. <laughs> we thought we'd reached it with Homecoming, then Downpour came out. It just keeps <laughs> happening. Sure you are. It, it's okay. I believe that you believe you're not lying. I believe you, sis. I don't give a shit about what you say. <laughs> it's not that I think you're lying, it's just that I don't care. I'm the protagonist. By the way, how do I identify if you're a protagonist in Silent Hill? If you're constantly surrounded by fog and you're wearing some kind of jacket. It's always the jacket. Well, uh, Henry. Henry didn't have a jacket. Did he had a dress a... shirt. He did wear a dress shirt. I'm looking for my mama. Henry, also... Henry wasn't a real Silent Hill protagonist anyway. Henry was just someone who kind of staggered. He got he... stuck in the middle of the plot. <laughs> I just realized this Let's Play is going to have a lot of Silent Hill jokes to people that probably don't care. Hey, you better get used to it. We're yeah. fat Silent Hill fans, so... I'm sorry for talking over what Angela is saying here, but... I just really don't care. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry, if James doesn't care, why should I? Yes, uh, a lot of the characters in this game have their own stories that they're uh, that, that, that aren't necessarily tied to James's. If they're important, but, well, that's up to you. But yeah, uh, it is worth... It is important to note, because uh, Angela's story kind of, you know... It comes in later. Well, it's not like it's something like, watch out, pay close attention to Angela's story. It's kind of, it's not subtle, so yeah. you won't miss it. Okay, let's keep going. Oh right. god, are we on this, oh god. The gravel sound? I hate these sounds. Don't worry. I hate when sounds are so obviously looping. 
That's one of my favorite parts about this. Uh, when you're running for extended periods of time, you'll hear footsteps behind you. Only in the beginning, though. Only in the beginning. You know, later when you're in, like, more claustrophobic areas. I'd just like to note It that doesn't. I'd just like to note that what I'm doing right now, this is done by pushing the X button on my Xbox 360 controller. This is the B button. Hello, my baby. <laughs> Hello, my baby. Hello, my darling. Hello, my ragtime <laughs> guy. It, it's better when I've got the uh, pipe, so it looks like I've got a cane. Yeah, as soon as he gets the uh, the 2x4, he's going to be swinging it everywhere he runs until he gets a pipe. Well, only outside, because otherwise it slows down my movement. Up oh, here, we have reached our first oh, graphical glitch. <laughs> okay, let's walk away from it and see if it comes back if we come back. Uh, I don't think we have to come back this way. Let's not come back this way, then. That's not a graphical glitch, that's just a barrel That's just drum. a barrel. It's a barrel drum. You Yeesh. did it. You found the thing. I don't that's think... not a graphical glitch. That's just bad aging. Are we sure? Because a lot of this shit looks like graphical errors. I'm not really sure anymore. I think, a lot, I think a lot of these are graphical errors. <laughs> oh, man. Our only other choice was to buy the... Uh... The digital download of the HD collection remake. And fuck that which because it would have been okay, but we're not stupid. It would look worse than this. Well, it actually would look exactly the same with a couple model differences and less smoke. That's all the HD remake does. Also, because you're playing from a disc, these take forever to switch from area yeah. to area. The loading screens can be a bit uh, tiresome. Not a bad mm. loading screen, though. Oh god, doors. Okay. Oh my god! Can I run? Door volume. More important than dialogue. It's because you gotta. You, I might not be sure that the door was closed behind me. What if it's a slightly ajar? Then all the monsters will follow me. That will make them follow you. Well, I mean, yeah, they can't open the door otherwise. None of the monsters in this game have any goddamn hands. I'd say maybe like. Two might have hands. Wait, are we including bosses? Uh, you know what? Well, I think the the one boss that you're in danger of running into outside of like a battle arena can kind of go out wherever that boss darn well pleases. <laughs> Doors really are not going to hinder him. And I'm starting it off right now. I don't know when this recording is going to end, so I don't know if I'm saying this at the end. I will tolerate no comment of Pyramid Head is sexy, he just wants a hug! Because that mentality is ruining horror games. It really is. Sorry, I'm just trying to see if I can get him to do funny walks. <laughs> what were you saying about ruining horror games? <laughs> I think I hang out right here. Again, though, not sure how much time we've been into this. Uh, I'm, you know, th this is gonna be the first, uh, oh! I just realized I have a recording counter at uh, in the corner of my you screen. You fool! I, 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 I've, I've never recorded something like this with bandy cam where I can actually still see the bandy cam window. So, what can, time we at? Uh, we're we're about thirteen minutes in right now. Okay, we're doing well. Hey, buddy, make up our way downtown. Walking, Walking fast, <laughs> James is passing. Yeah. By the way, this uh, this blood, still to this day, I do not know whose it is. Yeah, it's not like it matters. That is a van. Wanted, Good job, it, James. It could have been a monster. Yes, uh, this... Oh, goodness. The game gets better, I swear. I promise! We're still at uh, the portion of the game which is uh, a dramatic exploration of James's back. A save! A fence! Oh, wait. <laughs> okay. Uh, a save! I want that. Now, we're going to be going for what is called the leave ending, and in order to do that, I am going to need to be super cautious it's about the, uh, that. It's the, I'm not allowed to heal regularly route. Uh, the, it is I the need to heal relentlessly. I need to heal as soon as I take damage. Also, let's take a look at our inventory. Uh, this is the best inventory screen of any horror game, and I dare you to argue with me. Uh, I don't know, man. Silent Hill 4 and Homecoming had a really good inventory screen. You give a stop right now. Uh, <laughs> here is a picture of our wife. Well, Mary. It's lovely. She, she wrote the letter! She wrote no, the, that's see, see, the this lady. Is, this that's is definitely, the letter. 
definitely Mary's name on her own handwriting envelope. We and this is we the... got that letter. Special waiting. We, the letter. You cannot use this. And we have a bottle of Tabasco sauce. Which is awesome to pour on your tongue, by the way. Kids do it. I've always seen the Silent Hill health drinks as Tabasco sauce. We did it! Hi, James. Yeah, you get, get used to this face, by the way, because you're going to be seeing it a hell of a lot. I'm going to save, like, every single time I get the opportunity to. And we're also going to probably leave the console on and try to do this as much in one sitting as we can on because, the off chance it deletes the save. Yeah, I was going to say, the last thing I want want to happen is for the game to fail to boot again. Because uh, on our first attempt at a practice run, I turned off the game. We uh, had to practice run the first half of the game two separate times. Yeah, so uh, I, I, like, I, I, that whole the game, the, the emulator is shit thing, we learned that the hard way. Yeah. And this has been going on for a very long time. You'd imagine them, you know, some kind of patch to fix the Xbox emulator in the 360. Nope. Some kind of patch, but nope. Nope, connect. That's more important. <laughs> Huh, fine. Look at this radio. It's way more important than looking at the thing moving in the background over there. Radio? What's going, what's going on, on, with, on with that radio? Hey, sir, can you tell me what's going on with this radio? God, hey, hold on. I, I, need to, I need to turn down the volume a bit. <laughs> I'm sorry, the, game, the game's way too loud wow. right now. See, last time that we were playing this, I said, I've always called these things keys, but with their ass and thigh shape, I am inclined to say it is a she. To which Trask replied, why are you looking at its ass? Like, he didn't realize that entire scene was there. It has very feminine buttocks. Well, I mean, if you guys have ever played Metal Gear Solid, you know that paying attention to the ass is incredibly important and actually is necessary for progressing in the game. So, yeah. Uh, we actually don't have to stomp that one, so... Yeah, that's the easiest one in the game. It has the least amount of HP, and it does very little attack damage. Yeah, but I will let you know, those guys are going to persist all the way to the end of the game just because their attack is so freaking annoying. Mm-hmm. Is this thing broken? I just realized there was a chance my mouse has been in the lower right-hand corner of the screen this whole time. I just moved it out of the way. Oh, my... <laughs> You're a professional. I am the most professional. Uh, it was it was off over in the black uh, the blackness over on the far right, so it wasn't blocking any of the game screen. But James trying to listen to Nickelback, but it's not coming through. Truly, this is hell. Hey, look at this photograph. Every time I do, it makes me look at this photograph. Every time I look at this photograph, it progresses. Look at this me photograph. My... Every time I do, it makes me progress towards my. This you never want to have this off, if I recall correctly. I didn't even know people. Oh, you can adjust the volume? I never fucked with the radio. And this is, uh... Huh. Yeah, this... I probably would have turned it down had I known. That Un thing's loud. Unfortunately, with this, uh, we are going to have a, uh... Increased damage resist... Like, like, an increased damage vulnerability to bullets because uh, it is a pain train, but on the other hand, we also capture points twice as fast. There are people out there that have not played Silent Hill or TF2 and they have no idea what you're talking about and they think it's actually pertaining to this game. Gotta go fast. <laughs> and now you're just confusing the ones that happen to be Sonic fans. The number one goes the fast. Uh, Done it, James. Avoid that combat. I am going to avoid every bit of combat out on the street that I can because there are way too many enemies out here. Also, this they do respawn right as soon as you come out in uh, big areas like this, anyway. So yeah, there, you can't really clear the area. I mean, hallways. When it comes down to it, yeah, you want to get rid of them, but outdoors, there's no real point right, now, unless they're ganging up on you in a corner. Important to note: uh, if you do not go down this alleyway, you will regret it because you need to go down this alleyway before you can progress. Go down the alleyway. What are you waiting for? Going down the alleyway. Go down the alleyway. Get left for dead feels. Yeah, because this is where the tank appears. Yeah. Hello. Hey, buddy. No, come back. He's scared. I have no clue where he went. <laughs> he usually goes in that corner, but... Hey, buddy. You, you gonna be okay over here, man? 
Well, good to know that you showed more concern than James does. Oh, well, there's an apartment key. That's all I needed. Where'd Wiggly go? Oh, there he is. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye, friend. Goodbye, friend. Oh, by the way, that little weird whirring noise, that is the sound that's of... That's their noise. I think, that, no, I think that's the sound of the bugs. Oh, those are the bugs? I think those are the bugs. It's been so long since I played this. The bu Just think... watching you play, it makes it harder to associate what's coming from what. Big J's Burgers? Hot dogs? Why would they have a burger with it? Happy burger. Hot, hot dog. Hot dogs. You know, if, hot dogs get a bad rap. It wasn't safe to cross the crosswalk. What are you doing? You're gonna get hit by a car. There you go. It's better now. Now it's too late. We could cross again. Someone could get hurt that way. I can't hear you, know, you over the sound of all these monsters running around screaming. I think you learned something from Mary, gosh. It was awful. No one saw that semi truck. It was horrible. Alright, no spoilers, sorry. See? Hey, buddy! Okay. I hate that... those guys. They will drain your health if you don't kill them right away. All you gotta do is step on them, but they have to get close enough within your feet range. And when they're in your feet range, they're probably already attacking. Yeah. Loading, loading, loading. Loading, loading, loading. Loading. From a disc. Look, we made it to the other side of that gate. It only took us about 45 seconds. No, no, see, they would need to load a new cell because now you can't hear the the, uh, the radio making the sound to let me know there are all these, like, 5,000 enemies back there. I'm pretty <laughs> sure there's nothing you can do over here other than just go into the apartment right now. I just realized I can't make exaggerated time jokes because people are going to call me out and say, it wasn't 45 seconds, it was, like, 13. Because it was, it's a video. Watch, it was actually 13 seconds. <laughs> The, uh, this is probably the level I think everyone remembers the best from the game, because this is probably the point when a lot of people rage quit because of, uh... Because it was so freaking boring? This is not that it's boring, it's just so long. How long does the Bandicam window say? Uh, we are currently 20 to 22 minutes into this. You, you wanna, you, you, you wanna come back to this? I wanna come back to this, I'm gonna... Okay. I need to, I, guys... I know, I know, I need to save the game! I got a map! Didn't you just save? But before I got the map, things are Good. different now. Okay. Checking hard disk. Okay, we're good. I'll see you guys All later. All right, see you guys.